हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू अनदर वीडियो ऑफ सॉल्विंग एंड लर्निंग एसक्यूएल थ्रू एसक्यूएल क्वेरीज सो वी हैव ऑलरेडी सॉल्व अराउंड ट्वेल्व क्वेश्चंस इन द प्रीवियस टू वीडियोस इफ यू हैव नॉट चेक दैट आउट प्लीज गो एंड चेक दैट आउट एंड फ्रॉम दिस वीडियो विल बी सॉल्विंग द नेक्स्ट ईजी एंड मीडियम लेवल ऑफ क्वेश्चन इन एस क्यूएल एंड वी आर गोइंग टू बी डूइंग दिस ऑन प्लेटफॉर्म कॉल एस क्यू एल प्रैक्टिस डॉट कॉम सो लेट सी द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन शो द पेशेंट आई डी एंड टोटल नंबर ऑफ एडमिशन फॉर पेशेंट आई डी फाइव सेवन नाइन सो लेट्स गिव अ लुक अगेन इन टू द एडमिशन टेबल सो इन द एडमिशन टेबल वी हैव पेशेंट आई डी एडमिशन डेट डिस्चार्ज डेट डायग्नोसिस एंड अटेंडिंग डॉक्टर आई डी सो वी नीड द पेशेंट आई डी एंड इट शुड बी नंबर ऑफ एडमिशन फॉर द आई डी फाइव सेवन नाइन सो वी यू नीड टू यूज अ ग्रुप बाई हियर वेर वी ग्रुप बाई द पेशेंट आई डी फाइव सेवन नाइन सो लेट्स डू दिस सो वी नीड टू सेलेक्ट पेशेंट आई डी कम अकाउंट ऑफ स्टार फ्रॉम एडमिशन where patient id is equal to 2579 and we group by patient id so let's check the output and we got the output right so what we have done here is we have filtered it by patient id 579 and we group by patient id to find the whole number of count of that particular patient which has been admitted for multiple number of times and here as in this case we can see that it's two times so patient id 579 the same record as an entry two times in two different fields so we have tried to accumulate them so now we have used as count star we can use an alias as number of times so when you do this so the column name changes to number of times so yeah we got the answer correct So let's see the next question. We need based on the cities that our patients live in, show unique cities that are in province ID NS. So we need to show the cities which are in particular province NS. So that is the filter condition, and we need to show the output as city. So let's select city from the patients table where. Province ID is equal to N S, and we need to find the unique city names. So we use the keyword distinct and we got the output correct. So what distinct does is, if there's a particular city which is being repeated for multiple number of times, distinct just takes one record of it and just shows the city name only once. as you have seen earlier we got lot of records and it was because the same city name was being repeated again and again so distinct just took unique city names and gave us as an output and as a filter as a condition we have province id as ns and we have got the cities in the province id ns so let's see the next question so we have to write a query to find the first name last name and birth date of patients was height greater than 160 and weight greater than 70 so we have two conditions here so let's see how to use both conditions in one query so we have to select first name comma last name comma birth date from patient's table where the first condition is height is greater than 160 and we add the second condition by using an and operator so an and operator what it does is it just checks if both the conditions are only satisfied then only the output is displayed where if you use an or operator when either of the condition is satisfied the output is displayed so let's see how to use two conditions with an and operator we see height is greater than 160 and weight is greater than 70 so simple so just query it so we got the output correct so we see the first name last name and birth date and our conditions are running in the background which is height is greater than 160 and weight is greater than 70 so these are people with both the conditions satisfied let's see the next question write a query to find list of patients first name last name and allergies where allergies are not null and are from the city of hamilton so we have first name last name and instead of birth date we just type allergies here from frame patients table and we again have two conditions the first condition is where allergies is not null is not null
and the city is equal to Hamilton. So here we use is not null operator to find that the allergies is not null and the city is equated to city Hamilton. So let's check the output and we got the query right. So both the conditions are being used in this case and we got the output based on the query which we have written. We have got first name, last name and allergies where it is not null and the background the other filter applied is city is equal to Hamilton. So the next question is show unique birth years from patients and order them by ascending. So it's pretty simple. We just need to extract the year of birth from the patient's name. As we've seen earlier, we use the year function from the birth date to extract the birth years and we it should be unique and we should order it by ascending. So we just use select year of birth date and we use an alias as maybe a birth year and we select from the patient's table and here we have to use select distinct since they have asked for only distinct unique years and we are going to order it by year in ascending so we got the query right so let's see what has happened so we have found the birth year out of the patient's birth dates and we have ordered it in ascending order. We have used one function here, the year function is used to find the birth year and also we have used a statement called order by. What order by does it? It sorts the whole output result based on the conditions which we have given. So we have ordered by year and it's in ascending order. So we got the output in ascending order. So that's all for this video. I'll be solving more easy and medium level questions in the upcoming videos. So please subscribe to the channel and you'll be seeing more videos on SQL and also other tools which are used in data analytics domain. Thank you.